Folks, it's true. Elon Musk thinks solar sucks. And he's trying his level best to turn Tesla solar panels into the lowest cost, cheapest solar company in the US. And why is he doing this? He thinks solar sucks because solar doesn't make any money for him. Margins are low. He's got huge employee costs and he wants to turn this business around and become number one. He hates being number two or number three. My name is John. I run the My Solar Home channel on YouTube. I've been doing solar for the last 10 years. My Solar Home is devoted to everything solar, helping folks go solar, helping folks evaluate solar technology, understanding solar panels, helping you make sound financial decisions while you're buying something as expensive as solar. Now to understand what's going on with Musk and the Tesla solar panels business, we got to go back to 2006 when Pete and London Rive, cousins of Elon Musk, set up Solar City. And over the next 10 years, they built the largest solar installation company in the US. They are number one, but they were also number one making losses. They were hugely in the red. They were growing gangbusters, but they were, but they were burning through money like nobody's business. And in 2016, Elon had to bail them out and he bought Solar City for $2.6 billion and he turned Solar City into Tesla solar panels. Since then, he's been trying his best. Now, Elon doesn't like doing any business in which he's not number one. Tesla solar panels today is a distant number three. And he hates businesses which don't make money. You've seen what's going on with Twitter, right? He's letting people go right, left, and center. He's cutting costs. He wants to do the same thing with Tesla solar panels. And guess what he's been doing? So one of the first things he did was he sacked the entire sales team, almost all of customer support, and put everything on the web. Now this obviously got his costs down tremendously, but it meant that you, if you wanted to buy Tesla solar, you'd only be talking to a website. Very few people got to ever talk to a person. And this has been a recurring theme with Tesla solar panels ever since the last three, four years. Not only did Elon fire his employees, guess what? He fired customers too. In the last few months, a huge bunch of solar customers received letters and emails saying that, sorry, we can't do your solar project, you are fired. That's right, he even fired his customers. Now, all this must be according to a master plan that Elon has, but this master plan is not good for folks who are planning to buy solar. You really have a lot of uncertainty around Tesla solar and its future. He's been cutting costs, that's been his number one. Number two, he's been trying to grow the business by giving solar away at ridiculously cheap prices. And you know, you can't have the cake and eat it too. When you're offering really cheap prices, you're offering really cheap material. The panels that Tesla Solar give you are not really the top of the line today. They're good, but not the best. They do not use N-phase microinverters. They are using string inverters. So Tesla Solar today has problem with product. Everything is cookie cutter. They have limited system sizes, system size A, B, or C if you want something else. Getting a system size which is custom for you is very difficult. Making sure your project is built on time, really difficult because you just don't know if tomorrow he's gonna cancel your installation. Equipment, you have no choice. You have to go with string inverters. You cannot think of getting a, a, top, of the, a top of the line panel like the REC Alpha or the Q-Cell. No, you have to go with the Tesla panels. Tesla doesn't make solar panels. It buys panels from other companies and then it brands them Tesla. But these are not the top-notch, top-of-the-line panels. Most importantly, without N-phase microinverters or solarage optimizers, you have less production from your panels. Now, with all this uncertainty in the Tesla solar panel system, the dealers who work and who install systems, yes, every large company like Tesla, they use a dealer network to do their installations. Even though they might have branded trucks moving around, but the folks who are doing this work are local dealers who are dealers for Tesla. Now what's happened is some of these dealers are seeing an opportunity and they have become unscrupulous and they are trying to make more money. What they're doing is they're switching equipment without you knowing. Here's what standard equipment looks like 
when you do a solar install. You'll have a standard panel, you'll have a standard inverter. Now, when they sell it to you, they will give you 25 panels and XYZ size of the inverter. And this is what the inverter looks like. Now, when they come to install the inverter, some of these unscrupulous dealers, what they do is they switch your inverter. They give you something which is smaller in size. And hey, look at what the new inverter looks like. Boom, it looks exactly the same. There is no way you as a customer are going to know what is being installed. If you go on YouTube, you will see other videos of people complaining about this. I would not believe this at first, but it's true. If you're thinking about Tesla solar panels, there are so many things which could go wrong that I advise all the people who watch my channel to stay away from Tesla solar panels until Elon gets his act right. If you are interested in learning about solar and evaluating your home for solar, do email me, john at mysolarhome.us. I'll give you a custom quote. I have preferred solar partners who do installations across the United States. I'll be delighted to help you. And I promise you, I have the best, fairest prices and I give you the best equipment. Thanks for watching and have a great day. Bye-bye. <laughs>